Hey guys, Scott here. Uh, real quick, I just want to talk about the new map, Garden of Joy in Dead by Daylight, because um, I do think it has a couple of problems. It is, I'm going to just say, it is a really frustrating map to play on as killer. I think it is actually very badly balanced. Um, again, aesthetically, every time, knock it out of the park. Super cool, especially with like the collapsing stuff and all the outskirts and stuff like that. It's also one of the first maps that doesn't have a, a concrete border. It's not like it's just a perfectly square border where you can tell where the map ends and stuff like that. Um, but it has a lot of problems. So first let's go over uh, like the shack side of the map. So the shack side can spawn the shack and then next to it, there's two types of options. Uh, well, uh, in front of the shack, there's always going to be one kind of just crappy, just short little junk loop there. But on the other side, there's, um, going to be that kind of divot area. That's an area of crows. That's like the, uh, little like negative hill and, uh, it can spawn that, which is fine, but it can also spawn a rock loop. And if it spawns the rock loop, then you have the shack, the rock loop, a jungle gin, another like junk loop, and then another junk loop. And you basically have the entire side of the map connected as an in one giant loop, which is interesting because the whole thing that Dredge is countered by is having another loop to run to when he begins channeling his remnant and then going somewhere else. So this map ends up being terrible for Dredge. The locker placements are really bad. And the actual uh, ability to chain together loops in this map is insanely strong. So the dredge is terrible on this map, even though it's his own map. But I mean, that's a pretty common thing with behavior. They always have killers not do well on their own maps. But that's just the shack side of things. Now, the actual main culprit, the main completely busted thing about this map is the main building. Um, first of all, you just can't see in the main building. The lighting is legitimately broken. There's just no ambient lighting whatsoever. It is actually pitch black. Even if you increase the brightness of your monitor, you can't to find features that are not rendered in the game because it's actually zero lighting in there. So that just seems bugged. Um, that's like, doesn't even seem intentional. Um, and plus I've seen the switch version. It's actually much brighter. So it, it's definitely a bug that, that needs to be fixed. I've also had people start setting up shadow step in there, which if you do that, you can go straight to hell. It's already impossible to track people in that building, but that's just the visuals, the actual gameplay. There are so many God windows in that building. I feel like they just, I feel like they forgot to add some breakable walls or something like that. Um, it, it seems like they meant to have like, okay, this window is really strong, but we'll just add a break of a wall here. And then if we do that, well, then if you break it, it's not strong anymore, but they don't have any. And it just seems like they forgot to do that or something because it has three God windows in it. It's got one upstairs and two downstairs and the, the two downstairs ones don't even have stagger when you drop from them. So they're just short enough of a drop to where you're not slowed down when you land. So you can actually straight up infinite a killer if they just continually run around it because you can drop a bloodlust by uh, not running when you're um, in vision of them. And then when you get out of sight, you can walk for a bit and you'll still have enough distance depending on the killer to be able to continually run those windows over and over again. It's one of those windows where the only way to play it is just wait for entity blocker. And if you have a window that is designed where the only counter is to just wait for entity blocker, you've that's just a badly designed map. That's, they screwed up. It's basically like that old Haddonfield window that used to be at the top of the basement stairs um but there's three of them now in the same building and the problem is you can get to this building from most areas on the map it's sort of the whole crotus Prent asylum problem where this building is accessible for most areas in the map so if you hit somebody they can speed burst here the amount of times i've had to just abandon chases because people come to the structure is so un it just feels so bad as killer to have to just go okay well they got here. I guess I just lose the chase and then leave. Because if you do try to chase people in that building, you'll just lose. It's trying to, it's like trying to chase people in Dead Dog Saloon's main structure. Whereas that map, it's sort of kind of tucked in the corner. And there's a lot of other uh, gameplay to be had because there's, um, you know, it's not quite as easy to get there from certain loops. Um, and also there's only one generator there and that's it. And then you can ignore that area for the rest of the map and they have to go upstairs. Um, but this, it's not really the case. So I think that the main building definitely needs some type of nerf, even if they just add breakable walls near the God windows, just something like that to make it a bit more bearable. But as it stands right now, playing this map with the dredge feels absolutely terrible. Playing this map with basically any killer that's not the nurse or like hag with some good traps or something like that just feels terrible. And it's because the, the shack side can have all those connected loops where it's like the old Orman syndrome where the entire map is a connected loop. And then the other side has got the God structure with way too many God windows, the ridiculously broken lighting. Um, and, uh, yeah. Um, so that's it. I just wanted to rant about that map really quick. I do hope they change it a bit because it's very, very frustrating to play on. Um, but that's it. Thanks for watching. See ya.